Good day everyone, my name is Bright Chinedu Agbao. I'll be taking you on introduction to Core Draw Suit. Now, let's look at some objective. Objective is using various various menu bar for and graphic tools of Core Draw and also making use of the various toolbox. Now what is Core Draw? Core Draw is a most popular and powerful graphic program is basically used for designing and also it is built to design design to meet the day-to-day -day demand of designing okay now let's go to opening a core draw you click on your menu your startup button and locate the program you click on it and also go to the icon where the core draw is Pasted, you click on it and a dialog box appears like this and you see different features like the new graphics the open la last edit graphics all the rest and basically you just click on the new graphic where you do your design this is where you begin designs so now when you click on it you will see a background like this that will take us to the virus window components in corridor we have the title bar where the title of the graphic is being saved that is the name we have the menu bar this add this list the some various options or functions like the edit the file the view the layout and the effect of the corridor now the property bar this shows the dimension of the object or the dimension and location of the object where it's been placed and the two bar it's a bar that shows the shortcuts of some of some functions like the save the undo the redo etc the ruler is basically for the dimension of the objects both vertical and horizontal and the toolbox are tools used for editing and modifying an object in the core draw. Then the drawing window is that space around the drawing page, as you can see in the diagram there. And also the document navigation is also used to switch to one page to another. It's also shown at the right hand side you see in navigator there. The status bar and the color pilot color pilot is just a list of that shows the colors desirables and let's go to the main thing there is the toolbox toolbox overview now looking at all these things you will see them at the toolbox and the various window components in corel draw you will see the toolbox this will highlight them one after the other and talk about them and the first one is pick up pick to select ob uh, object this is basically used for selecting and moving of objects and the next one is scale to reshape object this is you can use it to reshape objects like making a square reshaping a square and all the rest then the zoom is basically changing the size the current view and the size of the size of the page the next one is freehand tool scale. This, these are basically for tracing a bit map and also grouping of objects. The next one is smart drawing tool convert. As you can use this one to convert a drawing tool to a freehand stroke. That is in terms of lines and curves. And the next one is the rectangle tools drawing draws this gives you rest angle shapes that you want and the next one is ellipse tools drawing this gives you different ellipse you want you want to use in your drawing and all the rest the next one is graphic paper tools the graphic paper tools is just like a graph in a uh, in our drawings when you click on it and you paste it on the paper you see a form like a graph 
Then the next one is perfect shape tools. It is basically like give you the shapes you want, the circle, the triangle, the square, etc. And the text tools is for typing, where you can type and edit words. The next one is interactive blend tools. It allows you to match objects. When you click on it, you can match two or three objects more than. Then the next one is the bitmap, especially the bitmap. No, sorry, it is the eye drop tools. This one is called the eye drop tools. This one is basically for to feed colors in an object. And the next one we're going to talk about is outlining tools. This sets the outline style of the object or in lines. These are dotted lines. You can basically use for dotted lines or straight lines, the thickness of the lines also. And the next one is fill tools. Yeah, it's basically to assign the fill style of an object. That is the colors, basically. And the next one is the interactive fill tools. It's almost the same thing with the fill tools. But this one is to fill out to fly out gives access to the mass field tools. Also, this using a mouse. You can use mouse to fill these ones, but this one when you just click on it, when the when you use the field tools to click on it, it gives you it fills the objects, but in the interactive field tools, you use the mouse for it. Then in summary, we talk about the features of Corel Draw, as the operating features of the Corel Draw also. We talk about how to begin how to begin a core draw that is the application itself then a brief description of the components of the core draw and also the various uses of the tools in two boss bar then the assignment here is what are the various what are the major components of core draw application when you Five.